a story in five words. Mariah makes millions at Christmas. All right, Heather, this pisses me off. Billboard estimates that All I Want for Christmas is You makes as much as six, hill, six million bucks in global revenue each year, with 1.55 million going to Mariah. And we all know, as you said at the break, it's the worst song you've ever heard. She sounds like a mating call for a tropical bird. Those were your words. Well, no. I actually, when I was a little girl, I loved Mariah. She's become a little wacky. Wow. Um, when you're a little girl, she, that means you're re you're younger. You're just saying Mariah Carey's like 60. No, she's 52. 52. Um, but she's still making over $6 million a year off this. It's One song. Oh, Christmas song. Yeah, but she did go on Stephen Colbert, who you are beating now, just to let you know. Oh. And she said. Thirsty applause. She said, oh. I only make one sixteenth of a penny for every download, uh, but we're still very thankful. Well, I'll take her chump change any day. Yeah, you know, um, you know, Sonny, this Christmas song strategy, I think that we all have to think about. All you got to do is hit one, hit it big, retire on it. I'm recording a song for next year called "Where Does Santa Poop." <laughs> you know that's going to go to number one again, or at least Although, number two. Yeah. <laughs> You're filthy. Go, Sonny. I just, I just I'm going to stay in my revolutionary phase <laughs> um, and, and say that the biggest beneficiaries of this are the men. And this is the patriarchy all over again. First is Nick Cannon because, hey, she can afford her two kids Christmas while he pays for the other nine. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and, and then the record label because... They get paid close to seven million, and she gets one of the seven. So right. they pimped her out real well. So either way, it looks like the patriarchy always wins. Wow, you are so left wing yeah. in like a completely <laughs> artificial way. It's amazing. It's like you're like me on the five. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Tyrus, I, am I the only person that hates Mariah Carey? No voice. Um, I love her. Nick she's, Cannon. She's, Nick Cannon ain't a big fan. Um, <laughs> Nick Cannon is a great person, okay? <laughs> and I'm happy he's got five more than I do. But he, he can afford them, so yeah. give Nick some, some slack. But man, you would think, I know this, though, from myself. Three in a year? Come on, man. Hey, hey. if you can, hey. I, I had three 11-year-olds <laughs> in 2011. Sometimes it just happens, okay? <laughs> How about that? But um, if I was getting paid a million six a year for one time a year, I would probably still remember the words to the song. Yeah. It's true. It's true. I was out doing uh, New Year's back when I had to for yeah. Fox, and she was performing, and she forgot the words to the song. So we got, and it was like, did she as really the, forget? As did, the new... As the new New Year guy. Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. This isn't sitting comfy with you and Pete. With Here's uh, hot chocolate and jacket. Yeah. Side no, no, cold. I was boots on the ground. <laughs> standing around people in piss diapers the because they didn't want to is... miss anything. <laughs> it's so true. They would all pee on themselves. And I stood around and I was like, no. Nah. <laughs> The piss Man. diapers are real. I think the lesson here I, is we'll see you on New Year's, uh, yeah. Fox and Friends weekend. <laughs> I will not. No, here's what I think. I think you're wrong. I think if you were getting mailbox money at $1.5 million a year, you would be mailing in everything. You would be getting that money regardless, and I think you'd forget the words to no. even that song. All right, we got to move on, you guys. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.